Online Pitching System for quick and simple setup. There's plenty of space for two campers and their gear. At the front, there's space to accommodate bags, while the PE doormat is the perfect place to store muddy boots. A window provides light and a view of the outside world. The Crestline 2 has sturdy fiberglass poles, which provide an ideal balance of strength and weight. The tense PU-coated polyester fly sheet with tape seams has a hydrostatic head of 3,000 mm, keeping even the worst rain out, while the durable PE ground sheet ensures a dry, bug-free sleeping environment. The inner tent is made from breathable polyester and ultra-fine mesh to ensure that even the smallest bugs are kept at bay, while adjustable ventilation tiles and double-layer mesh bedroom door allow you to manage the interior airflow helping to reduce the risk of condensation and maintain a comfortable temperature inside the tent. For increased peace of mind, all tent fabrics are fire retardant. Practical pockets and a lighting loop make it easy to keep small items organized and close to hand on the campsite, while the zippable power cord vent allows you to run power inside the tent to operate some extra home comforts. The Crestline 2's easy to pitch structure allows for an extremely quick and effortless setup in around five minutes. Roll out the inner tent and then peg the corners as anchoring points. Assemble the fiberglass poles. Place the poles across the inner and tie with the fabric tabs. Insert the pins into the pole ends on one side. Arc, then put the pin in the other ends. Clip the inner to the poles. Ensure that the door is shut. Tension, square up and peg the inner. Take the fly sheet over and tie to the poles with the fabric tabs. Peg down the fly sheet at all the pegging points. Extend and peg out the adjustable guy lines, pegging at 45 degrees for maximum wind resistance. The Coleman Crestline 2 for compact and convenient comfort on the campsite and festival field. I'm going to show you what they're all about. The Sumo Series has both a two and a three person model and I've got the two person here set up beside me. So the story with the Suma is how lightweight and feature packed it is for such an incredibly low price point. The Suma 2 weighs just 3 pounds 13 ounces which makes it one of the lighter two person backpacking tents on the market, especially when you consider the 30 square feet of living space and the 10 square foot vestibule that you get. So the secret to all that living space and low weight is the Suma's minimalist design. The two-pole dome structure keeps things super simple with one large door here on the front of the tent. Now it also maximizes headroom and elbow space so you and your hiking partner won't feel cramped after a long day on the trail. The tent and fly are color matched so the Suma is incredibly quick to set up which means you get to spend more time sleeping and less time messing with gear. Okay, so here you can see the Suma's asymmetric pole design. And basically all that means is that instead of crossing here in the middle, like a lot of dome style tents do, this one crosses here and that just gives you more room at the head of the tent there. And it just makes getting in and out of this door a lot easier. I've got plenty of room up here and since there's only one door, that's a great feature to have. The other nice thing that I really like about this tent is when you come in the door, it's got its own little stash pocket here. So a lot of times when you're out in the middle of the day, you have the door wide open. It's not flapping in your face. It's not rolling around. You just put it right in the pocket and it's good to go. Even when your tent mate crawls in and out of the tent all day. And as you can see, this thing is plenty roomy. So you and your hiking partner or partners have tons of room in the Suma. The gear loft here, obviously movable. You can move the thing around. I'm pretty tall and I've got plenty of, of room to sit up in here, especially with that thing gone. Uh, and she's got plenty of room as well, which makes everybody happy. Now the tent floor and fly are made of the same extra durable polyester taffeta blend, while the tent walls are a combo of a slightly thinner, more breathable poly blend and nylon mesh for more breathability. You also get a vent in the roof so things stay nice and cool even when you're riding out an afternoon storm in the mountains. The pack size is a super compact 5 by 17 inches so you won't have any trouble getting it to fit in your pack for the long haul. And the frame is a lightweight but super durable 8.5 mil aluminum. So all in all, the Suma is a new take on a backcountry tent that's all about optimizing volume while still remaining as lightweight as possible at a great price. It's quick. For those who love to play and sleep in the dirt, the Dirt Motel is the backpacking tent you've been looking for.
Available in two, three, and four person models, this double doored, double vestibuled tent is compact, lightweight, and features a roomy interior with the added bonus of an easily adjustable fly for stargazing. To set up your dirt motel, stake out the tent body in your Primo location. The lightweight, hubbed, DAC press fit pole system is easy to put together. Lay the poles on top of the tent body, matching the color coded pole segments to the correct corners. Insert the poles into the lightweight connector feet and raise the shelter into place. Add the ridge pole over the top and clip into place. Lastly, add the rain fly following the color coded cording. Secure the hook and loop to the poles, connect the corners of the fly to the pole tips, and then snug it up. Finish by staking out your vestibule and guying out your tent. Now climb inside and get comfortable in the spacious interior. If you want to enjoy a night of gazing at the stars through the lightweight no -seam mesh canopy, you'll be stoked with this fly. You can leave it rolled up as you drift to sleep. If you feel sprinkles, you can easily release these toggles, close out the rain, and get back to restful sleep. In the morning, it's easy to pack away the tent into the convenient double tapered shark mouth carrying bag. It's a perfect companion for short camping trips, touring breaks, or even festivals. It's exceptionally quick and simple to pitch thanks to its single poled, wedged tunnel construction and the ring and pin pitching system. Even though the tent has a compact size, there's plenty of space for two campers and their gear. Two doors provide pitching convenience and make entry and exit easy for both campers and there's space on either side for bags and boots. Windows provide light and a view of the outside world. The Bedrock 2 has a sturdy fiberglass pole which provides an ideal balance of strength and weight. The tent's PU-coated polyester fly sheet with tape seams has a hydrostatic head of 3000 mm, keeping even the worst rain out, while the durable PE ground sheet ensures a dry, bug-free sleeping environment. The inner tent is made from breathable polyester and ultra-fine mesh to ensure that even the smallest bugs are kept at bay, while the ventilation panel and full-width mesh double-layer door on one side allow you to manage the interior airflow helping to reduce the risk of condensation and maintain a comfortable temperature inside the tent. For increased peace of mind, all tent fabrics are fire retardant. Practical pockets make it easy to keep small items organized and close to hand on the campsite, while the zippable power cord vent allows you to run power inside the tent to operate some extra home comforts. The Bedrock's easy to pitch structure allows for an extremely quick and effortless setup in around five minutes. Roll out the inner tent and then peg the corners as anchoring points. Assemble the single fiberglass pole. Push the pole through the pole sleeve and insert the pin into the pole end. Arc and place the pin into the other end. Clip the inner to the pole. Ensure that the doors are shut, then tension and square up the inner. Peg all pegging points. Take the fly sheet over and tie to the pole with the fabric tabs. Peg down the fly sheet, starting at the front and working backwards. Extend and peg out the adjustable guy lines, pegging at 45 degrees for maximum wind resistance. The Coleman Bedrock for compact comfort on the campsite. winning Morrison 2, we've stepped it up a notch with increased living space and a more versatile design for three season weather. The included footprint allows you to use the fast fly configuration to save weight or use the tent as a stellar sun shelter. To set up the Morrison Evo tents, start by spreading out the included footprint. Add the tent on top and assemble the poles. Be sure to pass the gold poles under the green brow pole sleeve. Insert the tips into the grommets at the corners and then attach the clips to the poles. These clips save weight and help with breathability under the tent fly. Add the silver brow pole up top to create lots of headroom. Add the fly on top, clip the corners, and stake out the tent. These ventilation windows increase breathability on those hot, humid nights. Stay worry-free with our fully seam-taped and waterproof bathtub floor and rain fly. The vestibules at each door cover your extra gear at night. The two doors make it easy to get in and out, and the no -seam mesh wall panels allow for plenty of airflow. Inside, the detachable ceiling loft pocket is a great place to stash your headlamp, and down low, the mesh storage pockets keep your reading materials handy. The neutral colors of the Morrison Evo blend in with the environment and keep the bugs at bay. And it's a fantastic choice if you're looking for a great two-person, three-season backpacking tent. 
because of how much livable interior space you get for how lightweight it is. It only weighs four pounds, 13 ounces, but it's a full 88 inches long, and it's got a 55 inch width at one end for plenty of shoulder room, and then 45 inches at the other end. It's also got a peak height of 43 inches, which is pretty crazy when you consider how small this thing packs down and how little it weighs. Now the secret to all that headroom is the tent's offset ridge pole design, which you can see right here. So the offset ridge pole makes this tent incredibly livable for two people because it's offset towards the head of the tent, and that's where you need the most headroom. It's also really long, which gives you plenty of room on both sides near the doors. So beyond the headroom, the Midori also has some other great features like two full doors and two 10 square foot vestibules. It has two storage pockets and a gear loft for stashing all your stuff. And the doors actually have their own stash pockets as well so you can tuck them out of the way. It's also really easy to set up thanks to the color match clips and grommets for the rain fly. The Midori also has Eureka's high low vent air exchange system. So cool air enters the tent from this vent at the bottom. The warm air actually escapes from the vent at the top of the rain fly in the back of the tent. Overall, the Midori is a fantastic two-person backpacking tent that has a massive amount of volume for such a lightweight. If you enjoyed our video, don't forget to hit the like button below. And if you want to see similar videos in the future, smash that subscribe button and make sure to turn the notification bell on. Now that's all I've got, and in all that you do, we want to help you beat yesterday.